So somebody in one of my community posts asked me if I could start doing videos of me doing Hydra. And I figured why not. So what I wanted to do here is do a brutal key. And I'm just going to talk through it, maybe drop little advice, maybe give some of what my thoughts are, like what I'm thinking and how I'm making my decisions. I think that's what people are, are looking for, for those that like watching Hydra. Now, I don't really care about Hydra anymore. Like, I, I like seeing big numbers, but I don't really care about Hydra Clash anymore. And I don't really care about doing significant amounts of damage because I already one key everything. And I've been doing it for quite some time already. So for me, it's not new. It's pretty much just throwing everything on auto for the most part, especially for normal and Hydra. I just do my, I throw my keys in. I can auto, full auto nightmare, full auto brutal, but I wanted to do a manual run for brutal. Uh, we've had some people leave the clan as of late, you know, people quitting and whatnot. So we haven't been doing nightmare Hydra. So we're only focusing on normal, hard and brutal. By the way, if you're looking for a clan, and uh, you're looking for uh, an opportunity to come be in this clan. We have two spots open. So if you're a Hydra hitter, ideally, you know, doing Brutal or, or Nightmare or somewhere around that, um, then that would be pretty pretty cool. Join the Discord, let us know. But what I'm going to do here is take my Nightmare key, my Nightmare team, and put them in my uh, Brutal run. And I'll talk you guys through everything so that we could uh, just have a little bit of a chill moment here. Uh, when I edit this, I'll probably put some music in the background, just some light music, so nothing blaring, but this is pretty much it. My my face might come off at some point just so I could, uh, you know, because the light tends to tends to be a, a bit much, especially for a manual Hydra run. I think I'm just going to want to, you know, relax. But let's go ahead and do this. Uh, I'm going to start off by hitting this head here and spreading out the block damage and the attack. I could have started out with Tuana Rocks speed up, but we have Nekmothar coming in right away. So Nekmothar is in Provoke. He also plays the decrease speed. Provoke set doesn't matter too much right now because the head that cleanses is in here. What I like to do is focus on this head as much as possible, but I can't focus on the head because there's no Hex, except Venus is in Hex. Uh, she's in a Cursed set. And because she does a lot of AoEs, um, oftentimes this head, the head of Mischief, uh, receives the Hex and now he can be targeted. Um, so now we're going to just focus on this head. And he's usually my primary focus in the beginning. Luckily we had our block buffs up, so this Poison Cloud um, Hydra head didn't really have an effect or anything. I hate how he steals a lot of turn meter, because that means that I uh, kind of lose a turn of Hex that's on him. So yeah, I, I'd i like to be able to talk through the entirety of this run, but I'm going to run out of things to say. But if anything pops into my head, I'll, uh, I'll pop. You know what? Let me just put in some music and I'll put my headphones in. Let me just do this. By the way, Heartbound. Have a good playlist. Let me just lower this. Big shout out to them. They don't DMCA. Let's listen to some music. If I come up with anything to talk about, I'll talk about it. I really like Cupidus. He's an AoE god for Hydra, especially when paired with Venus, because every time he gets attacked, then he counterattacks. And it being an AoE and him being in a savage set is really nice. Loads and loads of damage. I wish they would speed up Inquisitor Shamil's animations, because sometimes he just does like seven counterattacks, and it takes up so much time. I did a guide on Nekmothar. Really like his his skill set, his uh his moves here. I did see that Synth commented he didn't really like Nekmothar for Hydra, that he's overrated. And it's mainly because of this head, where this head will have a counter that increases. And if you do a lot of AoE moves, then you're likely to proc his, uh, what do you call it? His, um, his passive. What's that? Just focusing on this head here.
But I don't I don't mind this head too much as long as you can get block buffs and decrease attack on him. I think he's relatively easy to deal with. This head, the head of Torment, pretty much useless as long as you have Inquisitor Shamael in. Is the music too loud? Let me see. I don't want it to be too loud. And if I'm recording this, and what I hear my, um, if I'm recording this, I can't really always tell what the volume levels are like on the receiving end. And I'd like to have no music, but I'm also the type of guy that likes to dry with music. So let's focus down on this head. He's about to heal and he's about to spread all those buffs so i need to get that out of the way as quickly as possible gotta go oh my god the last thing you want to do is to let him heal now when i see a decapitated head i often like to focus on that head before i didn't do that before i never focused on this head and my main objective was just to focus down on all the other heads but um so I gotta check, make sure I don't like roll my my desk uh, or my my uh, chair on my cat. But you do an extra two hundred percent damage to decapitated heads, so it's always an important um, task that you should go out of your way for to do more damage within Hydra. But yeah, before I was just like, oh, I'm just gonna focus on the other heads and not worry about these decapitated heads. But now I, I really think you should focus on these decapitated heads. I think I might spread this block, uh, spread dam- well actually no, let's, let's go ahead and spread damage to this head over here. That's the head, that's the- or sorry, that's the, of course that's the head. This is the, um, the head Synth was talking about as to why he doesn't like Necmothar. Because whenever he attacks, he, he hits really hard, so. I hate it when Brimstone pops off on decapitated heads, because it ends up not proccing at all. Oh, and I feel like the music might be too loud. Just lower it. 65. Because, like, I, I want to hear my music, but if it's too loud for you guys, it's not a good thing. Okay, we got this head again. Hopefully we get the hex on him. We did get the hex on him. Get the HP burns up, trying to do as much damage. I hate this passive. This passive that the head of uh, all these Hydra heads get when they first, when they're like a newborn head, this, what do you call it? Serpent's Will decreases damage that they all receive. It's really annoying. Let's just focus on these heads here. Then he steals turn meter, so he's got like half a turn f filled up already. Damn. And he's got the block, block uh, buffs, so I can't. But I can do this. That's why I like having Venus. I can take, and he just takes it again. Damn it! Honestly, screw this head, dude. One thing I do like to do, if these decapitated heads weren't here, I would like to focus down on this head because this counter. I'd like to get this counter. Um, filled up so that I can make him proc his passive while he has decreased attack and block buffs up. Something that I'd like to do. And we have one turn of increased attack. I think what I want to do is just really hit this one as hard as I can right now. 865k. Let's hit this head. I forgot what I have Shamael built. Oh, he's in Guardian. I like Shamael in a Guardian set. Come on, Hex. There you go. Let's spread it. Fuck yeah, spread it.
Now I do want to hit this decapitated head, but I really want to get this head out of the way too. And now we've been eaten. I think I should start focusing on this head here. Try to release this head as quickly, or release my champion as quickly as possible. There we go. Let's place the decreased defense and weaken. Let me move this over here. Oh, by the way, guys, don't forget there are promo codes. Um, let me see what the current ones are. We have... I think Raid Community is still active. I just tried this one. I don't think it's active. It's expired, but Ash celebrates. I think you have like five or six days left to use it, so maybe even less. Spread it. Hopefully the hex spreads. It doesn't. It doesn't spread and increase. Maybe I could hit him with Venus one more time. Maybe this is it? Nope. Missed it. It didn't land. I do like Inquisitor Shamael in Savage also. He's a really great champion. If you put him in Savage. Come on, take the Hex. There it is. It is only, what, 30%? It's a 30% chance. And they all have burns up, so we'll save it. Got the block buffs on. I can just go on auto for a minute here. And uh, just focus on that head. Save a little bit of time there. And this poison cloud can be so annoying. The worst thing that could happen, right, is if you have this head, who is really tanky, the head of suffering, and he's got the poison cloud up, he's eaten one of your champions, he's about to take two turns, because he takes two turns sometimes, like now. And this guy places a poison cloud on top of that. I'm just like, <laughs> it's the worst situation. I would just restart the run. Alright, now we've got this head of Wrath. Again, let's try to get the decreased attack on him. I try to avoid attacking this head if he doesn't have block buffs and decreased attack on. Otherwise, he'll hit hard and end the run. Let's get decreased attack on us, and let's hit the Head of Blight. Let's remove this Reflect Damage. Sometimes I use Inquisitor Shamael because his A1 allows for you to sometimes decrease the buff duration. Decrease attack. Tawana Rock. Give me that block buffs. Oh, he didn't get the block buffs on. Let's focus on this head. I'm trying to get this head down. Uh, this head has a passive that decreases damage from AoEs, so a Cupidus specifically. 30%, that's a lot of damage mitigation for their, for them. So I try to get rid of this head too whenever I can, but he's just not my highest priority. Oh crap, he's got the increased attack on. I should just activate it while he still has, um, what do you call it, the uh, decreased attack. Let's activate this. Not ideal, but it's okay. We're okay. Try to get that. Decrease that duration here. Let's get block buffs up on this champ. Or Hydra Head, I mean. Yeah, because you can, you can lose so much HP. Luckily, we had Leech on. So Nekmothar has Leech. So you saw that Cupidus attacked. And he lost some health because of this deflect damage. But he also healed a little bit. Because of the heck or the because of the the leech that's on everybody. 
There we go. We decreased the buff duration. That's what we wanted. There we go. Look at that. He hits so damn hard. Let's get some extra damage in. Increase speed. And let's get this block buffs on. Oh, come on. Where, how are you not getting the block buffs, dude? That's so messed up. Maybe I have to... I forgot what, what it was. Am I supposed to target him specifically? I thought they would spread. I forgot to one arc skills. I, I always forget everybody's skills. If you want to get block buffs on, I think I have to target her, um, this head specifically. Decrease attack, Necmo, come on. God damn this head. Hate this head. Yeah, it was gonna activate anyway. Which is which is fine. I prefer it to happen now while he's got decreased attack on. This head is going to cleanse, so I'm just going to attack this head. Or this, yeah, exactly. I forgot Swanrock has decreased speed on. Oh, you bastard. Alright, let me see if I can get to him quickly enough. Maybe Necmo's provoke will proc. It did not. Let's just attack this head then. Alright, yeah, I get it. This is going to hurt. He's going to hit me really hard right now. Hmm. Don't counter attack. Oh boy. Decrease attack. No fudgical sticks, dude. Fucking hell, man. This is a situation you don't want to be in. <laughs> Look at this. Deflect damage, ally protect. Venus, do your thing. There she goes. Love Venus. Gotta love her. Let's throw it on auto and focus on this head here. While he doesn't have his counter up. Honestly, I think Venus saved us there with the passive. Oof. Got the Provoke on. Twanarok's passive should cleanse everybody. There you go. She's looking a little low, though. There we go. Looking okay, looking okay. What I don't like is even though he's stunned, he can still attack you with his passive. If that hits uh, 14, the counter hits 14, it's so dumb. I don't like it. Like, he's stunned. Why is he attacking still? Why am I still receiving damage? Doesn't make any sense. This head's about to cleanse everything. I'm trying to get as much damage as I can to this head here. Before that happens. Yep. Right, let's go back to manual. You can do this. Oh, I shouldn't have attacked that head. Uh, let, me, let, me, let me move over here to this head real quick for a minute. Decrease attack? Nope. I, okay. We got provoke. Oof. Oh my god, yeah, that's what I'm trying to avoid. Alright, let's revive. 
They're about to eat Venus. They're about to eat Venus. Okay, next head that takes a turn is going to eat Venus. It's probably this head. Let's do this. Try to go fast enough to prevent this from happening. Well, it's not going to prevent, actually, but we can do our best to control who's going to eat. I think it might be this head. Although I guess it would have been preferable to have the head of mischief, or head, this head, that head, um, eat Venus. This is going to be harder to get Venus out of, so I kind of screwed myself there, to be honest. But, live and learn. It's okay. Oh, this head is the one that ate. Is going faster. Okay, no, it all worked out. That all worked out for us. Do a little full auto action here. Try to do it before they... Yeah. I'm gonna put the shield on himself. Alright, so for now, let's just focus on getting the decapitated heads. Oh, we got the provoke off. Maybe we can also get the stun. If we can hit him hard enough. We got another provoke on. Very nice. Nice, we got the block buffs. I don't mind too much if he himself receives the poison cloud. There we go. Let's try to keep the pressure on this one. More provokes would be nice. We are in negative affinity there. All right, let's go. Let's go back to manual real quick. Let's remove that, and then let's hit the right here. That that way, this head will take a turn, and the poisons will take. Hey, we. Let's hold off, focusing on this head until we get the hex on. Oh, you jerk! Don't heal. Come on, land the freaking Hex. Why didn't you... It said it got resisted. Venus has enough accuracy. What are you talking about? Fuck, dude. Hate this head so much, dude. Freaking hate that head. Let's get some block. Can we get some block debuffs on before this jerk decides to spread everything? Really? Come on, decrease defense. We and we get the hex then. Now we can attack. We don't have a lot of time, though, because he's going to take one turn, then he's going to steal turn meter, and then he's going to take even, like another turn so quickly. Got to get Duchess out before then. Fifty K on Brutal? Not, not bad. Dude, stop stealing my heals, bro. Got that head out of here. Get out of here. Let's 
So annoying, dude. Okay, let's try to get rid of this head. God, chill. Let's get the hex off of him now again. Come on, hex. There you go. Block buffs. Get the block buffs. Fuck. Well, now it's too late to one rock. Come on, take it. Ah, I forgot the poison cloud, damn it. <sighs> Gotta slow down. Let's not put up block buffs. Let's hold off. Maybe I should have put up block buffs. This is gonna hurt. Yep. That is not the head I want to see right now. Oh, oh, keep it as might save it. Keep this might do it. Come on, keep it as somebody let him out. No, Necmothar. Screw it. it, runs over. Maybe Venus needs to go faster. Maybe I need a faster Venus. Like, I, I don't know what her speed's at right now. 240? 260? Something like that? Whatever it is, it's too slow. Because she needs to be going through her moves a lot faster for me to reliably place a hex. Auto it. I think at least we'll do like what sixty mil. You know what I need? I need like a, a Crisk or something. Or an Iron Gut. Should've focused on this head. That head, I, I tell you, this head smacks hard. Yep. Didn't even get my champion out. Oh, it's over. I can't I can't get Duchess out in time. Yeah, 60 mil. Respectable for brutal. It's not the craziest. 
Oh, we got we got her out. It's over. Freaking cat hairs keep floating around, dude. They won't die. <laughs> they keep coming back. Not that I'm complaining. Right as this head's about to cleanse it, she does that. Very nice. 64 mil on Brutal. So I guess, you know, how would I improve it? Probably make Venus, Tuanarok, and Nekbothar faster if I can't. Well, I just make everybody faster in general. That or I need somebody in Hex gear with an AoE for an A1. So, yeah, not not my uh, not my best run. Sixty four mil. How fast is Venus going? Oh, she's going pretty slowly. Yeah, that's pretty slow. That is pretty slow. Pretty slow. Got anything faster? Already with speed. Keep her in perception. Uh, I think this might be my best banner right now. For her, yeah. Because I don't want to take gear off of the other champions. So, solution, farm gear. Go farm. I need to farm. <laughs> 